Hi, good evening. We're gonna go over the scope of analysis feature of business subject. We're creating a simple uh, web report from our uh, famous eFashion universe, which is gonna use the uh, uh, state store name and um, year dimension. Simply going to run the report and uh, actually before running it, let's uh, check out the scope of analysis. And by default, it's none. Let's uh, what what it means is is basically a level of drill down, level of available dr drill down, um, available um, drill down level of data, I guess. Uh, so if you are on one level, it shows you a quarter because we selected a year already. If we do uh, two levels it shows us month if we do three, three levels it should show us week okay so that's what um basically is we'll run the report and we see that uh, we have year and uh, state name and store name if we uh, click on the drill mode we'll immediately see that uh, the year column will be underlined that means we can drill down on it. If you click on it, it will just go down to next level, which is quarter. If we click up, we could go back up to here again. But let's uh, go back down, drill back down to uh, quarter. Next level will be month, and um, the following level will be uh, week, as we've seen before. Of course, you can format these. Uh, numbers to text uh, in any way you want so we have the week if we click further we have another um, dimension I guess that's it's probably a flag holiday yes and no that's a flag so that's the default behavior if any user has uh, the drill down ability he or she can uh, uh, drill down to all the available fields that are uh, associated with uh, the dimension. We are going ahead and purging this document and running this report once again. But since we've drilled down previously to weak level, uh, it still retains that uh, level of data. We'll have to drill up uh, or simply purge and uh, read on this report or remove this column and read on it. Otherwise, it's, this is simply pulling this data from uh, the cache at this point so we have the year column still underlined which means we can uh, drill down but what if we wanted to um, instead of um, going from um, a year to quarter and then month, what if we wanted to jump directly from year to say month we would have to go to the designer of course and actually the universe and set that specification by default Business objects has a hierarchy set uh, based on how you uh, based on how you design your universe. It has a default hierarchy. Um, in this case, the default hierarchy is year, quarter, month, week, and holidays. Instead of default behavior, we'd want to get uh, our own custom hierarchy. Let's remove all of them and uh, drag in all uh, the existing um, hierarchies, and we'll just simply. Uh, eliminate whatever we don't need let's go to time period and we'll just eliminate quarter and we'll get rid of um, the holiday also just so you know think of it as a real life scenario your manager may not uh, want to see the quarters and so on so we'll click ok and we'll um, save it and we'll of course remember to export it if you just save it it saves the universe locally so get to export it once it's exported we'll go back uh, to our um, info view close this report out um, actually we haven't even saved it let's save it call it scope of analysis save it in our favors folder and we'll just read on it again we'll exit out So that's our report. 
let's see if uh, we could uh, drill down from year directly to month so here again this is the cached version we'll go to edge query scope of analysis so we had a custom to week before I was pulling from cache we'll run it again now we're in drill mode so in drill mode let's see as I'm highlighted it says uh, drill down to month bingo this is what we wanted it doesn't say quarter anymore we clicked on it it goes to month click on it, it goes to week and after that there is no more drill down so quarter is eliminated and holiday uh, dimension is also eliminated perfect this is exactly what you wanted thanks for watching this was a small demo of scope of analysis on business subjects xir2 for more video and tutorial visit letslearnbi.com